Hello everyone, this is Argon Matrix, welcome you to episode 10, finally in the double digits, of Super Mario RPG. And, um, in the last time we were just watching these pendulums, no, no the, not these pendulums, these platforms move around like pendulums. So yeah, um, we don't need to do that, what am I thinking, we already got that block, whatever. Alright, so we're done here, that's the only point, we got a frog coin from that block. Awesomeness. And yeah, so we're just gonna go ahead and jump right in here. Wait, wait, wait a minute. No, I don't want to do that. There we go. That's what I want to do. That's what I... Wait, who's that guy? Look at him over there. He looks like an ant or something. He looks he looks like a Marvin the Martian. Oh my god. Let's, let's go fight him. Gotcha. Haha. -ha. Right, so... In reality, these guys are running away from us with their large bags of money. Yeah, so those guys tend to run away, but if you manage to kill one, if it stays around long enough for you to kill it, or you're just faster than it and they're able to kill it in the turn you get, then they will give you a lot of coins. So, they can be quite useful for grinding monies. Alright. So, let's just move on here. Um, is there anything here? Doesn't look like it. No hidden things for me. Alright, um, oh, what the hell? Oh, I think if you, like, fight five shy guys on this guy, uh, from this thing, that are hanging from this thing, then you get something from him. So we're just gonna go ahead and try that. Alright, here we go. Anything here? Alright, nothing new in this battle, but I'll leave it in just for the hell of it. I mean, you like, you like me talking to you, don't you? You like the lovely sound of my voice? Even though it doesn't compare to the lovely sound of voice or excellent commentary of people like, uh, Donabella's, I guess. That's the first one that comes to mind when I think of nice voice. Anyways. Alright, so I'm just gonna cut out this battle at least. Alright, here we go! Alright, that was fantastic! Oh, and there's another one. Well, I'll show this one. How about that? I'll show every other battle, even though they're all the exact same thing. Jeez, 64 damage. Yay! Ah, oh, if only it had a f another 5 damage. Then it would have been an awesome number of awesomeness. Uh, by the way, today, the day that I was recording this, we did the Terry Fox run at school, so that's awesome. And so be sure to remember Terry Fox, because he was a good guy. He, oh, well, <laughs> he just charged into battle and ran away. What was the point of that? But yeah, and for those of you who don't know, by the way, these are Snapdragons. They actually, they're actually pretty tough, if I remember. But for those of you who don't know about Terry Fox, which I'm sure many of you do know about him, he tried to, he was like a cancer patient, and he had his leg amputated from cancer, and he started a marathon of hope to run across Canada on his one leg, and it got really popular, and it raised a lot of money, but in the end, he made it to Thunder Bay, he started in like, uh, Newfoundland, I think, made it to Thunder Bay, and this cancer spread to his lungs, and eventually it killed him. But, we still continue, we look, I have a Terry Fox run every year at our school, anyways, and apparently at every school in Canada. So, that's nice. And I believe today's, um, all, from all around the world, the Terry Fox Foundation has raised over 400 million, oh wait, over 500 million dollars for cancer. So, be sure to donate to that, because it's very nice. Alright, so, that's enough of the stupid, like, well not stupid, but needless public service announcement. Alright, and we're done with that. Yay. Alright, any more? Uh, whoa, whoa. Hey, you threw a mushroom at me. Yay, that was awesome. That was kind of cool. It's kind of pointless, too, because I didn't need the mushroom, but... Hey, money. Uh, what does this one take me? Okay. Can I get these coins? No. Alright, fine. Oh my god. God, what is it about Super Mario RPG that makes that makes my capture card drop frames? Like, seriously, I'm looking over at it right now, and there's like 68 frames dropped so far. Like in the last in the last recording session, there were a lot of frames dropped too, but it seemed gradual. So I don't know. Anyways, there's a lot of question mark boxes here. All the shy guys on top of them. So um, we're gonna fight each and every one just to see what we have inside of these. I know for a fact that this one's a healing mushroom, so we're gonna save that for the last one. And we're going to go ahead and start with this guy. And yeah. Alright, awesomeness. And what's in this one? A bunch of coins, okay. Yay, money. Alright, um, and there's a bandit here. Let's fight him. 
Yeah, let's see if we can actually kill one this time. Not you, and... Oh, you! We got a chance to kill this guy! Oh my god. Let's not waste it. Super jump his ass. Yay! That's how you do the super jump. Oh my god. I, I can't believe, like, in the blown battle, I was doing, like, two or three, maybe, or four or whatever. There I did. I don't even know how many I lost. I couldn't. I didn't count them, so. But still, that's awesome. Ah. Uh, you stupid shy guy. I'm gonna name you Joe. You know? Maybe not Joe. How about Steve? Yeah, because you just get in the way of everything. Like, all these stupid shy guys, they're muting me, and it's no fun, and I hate them. Anyways. Um, oh no, I want these coins, I want these coins. Yay, yeah, oh my god. Alright, so in that battle, I kind of started running low on health, so I think we're gonna go ahead and heal up a little bit here. Use some of our vast amounts of mushrooms. And continue on our way. And, and we'll fight this bandit first, why not? I don't know why, but I like leaving in battles with bandits for some reason. Oh my god. Do we actually get two chances to kill a bandit? Okay. So I know I can kill one with a knock-knock shell now, from the last battle, but can Mallow kill one on his own? No. Oh, but he stayed around! Oh my god, we're actually gonna get to kill two bandits and get a butt-ton of coins. A butt-ton? Who's ever said butt-ton? That's a strange word. Honey syrup, 20 coins, 10 XP. Not too shabby. Alright, and... Take on this guy, oh my god. Alright, and fight. Alright, that was a fun battle, but not really. It was kind of annoying, but who cares? Alright, oh my god. Well, I'll just leave us in. Who ca Who cares? Oh my god, you ran away. What a nub cake. Eh, let's super jump. No, let's let's actually fire orb the arachne. Because I would think that fires are weak to... F not, not, that fires are weak to fire, that spiders are weak to fire. I mean, wouldn't it only make sense? Kinda, not really. There's no evidence suggesting that that spiders can burn. Well, there probably is somewhere, but I never heard of it, man. Alright. And we'll kill the Steve. And yes, I stole that name from Trigger Condor's Pikmin LP. Sue me. Whatever. And I believe this is the full heal mushroom, and we'll just run away from that guy, because we don't want to have our full HP diminished by that stupid noob. Okay, and I saw a buttload of Goombas over there. What are they doing? They're all just lined up, looking in that direction. Right. Mal, don't be an idiot. Oh, crap. Oh, my God, it's Bowser. What's he doing here? This is the strangest thing ever. They're all getting organized, because they're silly. All right, people, form ranks. Attention, shelled warriors. Hooded sorcerers. And last but not least, ground Goombas. And they just do some kind of... What did the Goomba do there? Like, made some kind of, It made it glow red around or something? It was like, wow, wow. The Koopa Troop is invincible. We shall be victorious. Well, the bridge is down, but we'll find a way to get back in. Move out on the double. And Bowser's just sitting there laughing his happy ass off. Oh my god, he's creepy. Just like that guy from Majora's Mask. Oh my god, I can't even think about Majora's Mask right now. Not after that stupid fan fiction thing I read. I didn't even know it was a story at the time. I'll talk about that more when I actually record Majora's Mask. But, yeah. Bowser and his troops must be on their way to the ba to Bowser's Keep. Come on, Rose Town is just up ahead. All right, and we're going to end off our episode in Rose Town. We'll do some stuff there because we're not even close to near the time limit. So, yeah. And oh my God, what? That's a nice, pleasant sight to see when you first enter a town. Just someone getting hit in the head with an arrow. See, arrows come flying out of the forest, and when you're hit, you can't move. See, look, I can't move a muscle. Now I know how a scarecrow feels. And you just stay that way forever? That's horrible. Like, full body paralysis is no joke. Since the day the shooting star fell into the forest, arrows have been showering in our town. Ow. I, I can't move. Oh, I hate that. Wouldn't that be so horrible, though? Just to be walking around one day, get hit in the head with an arrow, which would probably hurt like hell, and then you can't move a muscle at all? I tell you, it's scary out here, but someone's got to pump the water. Yeah, I suppose so. You gotta do the damn chores. They might get in the way sometimes, but you just gotta do it. Grandpa's pumping some water for us. I wish we could help too. Well, you probably can. Just go out and pump some water with him. I'm worried about my grandson. He went out to play, but didn't come back when he should have. Uh-oh. 
Maybe we'll have to deal with that later. We're told not to go outside, cause it's too dangerous. Eh, <laughs> cuz. They don't say because, they just say cuz. Alright. I wanna go somewhere, someplace fun. Standing around here is so boring. Then why don't you move somewhere? Were you hit with an arrow, I guess? That's kinda what it looks like. Alright, I think you can go up here and go down. Yay! That was entertaining. Alright, so that's a secret little hidden flower that you can get if you want. Hello, Mario. It's so nice to for you to drop by our shop. What can I get for you? And we got some new equips and stuff here. Some new items. We got a thick shirt for Mario. We'll buy that. Thick pants for Mallow. Jump shoes. We already got those. And we got already got all this, I guess. And wait, we don't have any fearless pins. I'll buy one of those, sure. Alright, and let's start equipping stuff. So, here we go. Thick shirt. Um, raises... Raises it by a little bit. Not too bad. And the pants... Raise it by also a little bit, a little bit more than Mario's even. And we are done with that, I guess. Let's sell our weapons, I guess. I guess, I guess, I guess, I guess, I guess. We don't need the hammer or the shirt or the pants. We'll just keep the pins for now. And what do you say? Mario, good to have a customer at last. What do you need? And you sell the recovery items, which I don't need at the moment. I don't think. Maybe I'm just being stupid. Maybe I actually do need them. I probably do. I need two. It's like... Wow. Oh, this is not good. Now I can't go to the forest to chop wood. Chop up any wood. Oh, so you're going to deforest the area? Well, it's good. Well, then it's a good thing that you're frozen there, buddy. No, I don't wish paralysis on anyone. My husband still doesn't come back. I wonder what's keeping him. Well, maybe you could just... Oh, I hate it when that happens. When they like, walk through you and you get randomly stuck there. But yeah, you could just take a peek outside and he's right here. I th at least I think that's your husband. I can't move. Yeah, someone else said that too. There's a stairway that leads up to my house. My son's been playing with the controls again. Mara, if you could jump up there, please get me, help me get up back to my, get back up to my house. All right, just stand still for a minute, and I'll get up here. Sweet. And we got some stuff here. Yay! Awesome flowers. Kind of stole those from him, but oh well. What's taking Daddy so long? Do you think he's still looking for the treasure? Yeah, whatever. Wait, treasure? Was that? I didn't know there was treasure around these parts. Or there be treasure in these parts, my mateys. Thanks a million, Mario. Say, were my treasures okay? Uh, they sure were, yeah. Let's just leave it at that. Oh, that's great news. What a relief. Uh, man, we'll just kind of saunter away. Just go, just, le oh my god. What happens if one of those hits you anyways? Do you, do you lose the game? And you all just lost the game now, haha. <laughs> Mario, help! Brahaha! Hey Mario, I'll be taking care of Princess Toadstool now. Oh, this is cute. This guy's just role-playing Mario. Boing boing! Super jump attack! And... Oh! Looks like Mario's horrified just seeing himself getting bashed into the staircase there. Gooha! You think you can hurt me with your child's pranks? Attention Toadstool, you're coming with me! Zip your lip! Help! Help! Somebody help me! Help! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Is it? It's ma 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 I will say you betcha, just to please the little boy. How do I know it's you? You might just be pulling my leg. Show me. Prove it. Jump. Alright. Hey, Mario. Want to play with me? I'm playing Save the World. Now, gas. Mario might be a little tired, tired dear. Aw, oh, come on, Mom. You never play with me. It's no fun playing alone. Play with your son once in a while, little lady. Oh, dear. Mario, I hate to ask, but could you play with gas for a little while? And eh, no. No. No pain. I mean, better than a sharp stick in the eye. Yes! Yes! It's the epic yes! Mario just bought for, but just bought the farm, so, um, you can be Bowser. I mean, I'll be Gino. Who's Gino? What the? What? Let's get... Let's... Oh, what are the... Mario's playing as Bowser. That's really weird to see Mario play as Bowser. Ooh, scary, but just watch me! Better watch out, Bowser, because Gino's gonna blow you away. Take this! Ow! And Mario's gonna ram the little kid, I guess. Dude, Mario, child abuse. Really? 
Oh, oh no, if he keeps this up, I'm finished. Alright, you asked for it. This super duper custom patented and one one and only shooting star shot. And oh, oops, I uh, I think I missed. Ah, you just hit me in the face. Oh, oh, oh. And bleh.